is an occasion to ensure that we are an, an anti are part of the entire Africa with Ghana and this marvelous community of people of people of Africa. We as people of African descent. Thank you, Your Majesty, and thanks to this town for this kind of recital. As the first Afro-descendant Vice President of Latin America and the Caribbean country, this is an opportunity to speak to you not only in my own voice, but behalf in my country and also than more than 200 million of people of African descent in the Americas and the Caribbean. We are, we are part of the, of the dreams of a hundred of people, a million of people of African descent in the other part of the, of the world. We are here to build a new future with you people, with us, that guarantee well-being and decent life for all the people in Africa and for people of African descent. We come to build bridges and to meet again and build a new history. Today is a very important day, not only for me as a daughter of, of Africa, because we have the opportunity to be part of those who write this new history. The joy that we, sh we receive us is the joy with, you, with, with which the family the family, the African family receive because we feel at home. Thank you very much. This also, this is also our home of people of African descent. We bring a message of peace and union, a message of love for joint construction. Those of us who are part of the African diaspora understand that our only option is to work together as African people. I salute the African women and girls as protagonists of this new history. Thank you, thank you, and thank you. F 500 years ago, our ancestors were violently stretched from this continent. Today, we return to reunificate to recognize the culture and our history and to advance for the rights we claim. For the heart of my, for the center of my heart, thank you very much. Millions of Afro-descendants people hope that those of us in leadership position can unite to work together to the dream of the Pan-Africanist Marcus Garvey, that the black people of all over the world should work united.